Okay, dear friends, I do not know how I come here. I just feel that I am stuck. Cannot find an idea of how I continue. So I will just see how I will move on with this. There's no idea. So often time, what we struggle is not really It's not really um, I don't know so often time what we struggle is not uh, only skill or technique is that the more often I feel is that we have no idea what to paint and uh, that is the biggest pain in our painting. Do you agree? I always feel so that we are stuck in something that cannot find an idea. Sometimes we look for idea here and there. We can find there are a lot of uh, information source we can rely on. There is uh, internet, always very easy to get access to, to get idea from, but uh, they may not be. The problem is that our brain does not really work to provide us with enough idea and we get lost there. Sorry, I don't know what I'm talking about. I'm just uh, just uh, feel a little bit lost. Actually not a little bit lost. I feel big time lost and I do not know what I am doing. And uh, at this time the thing that can help me is to keep looking, keep looking for for the idea that um, that is already there, just uh, hidden and. Uh, not easy for us to find out. Keep on and on and oh, this is like telling a story. <coughs> Make up a story and. Uh, then you will struggle in finishing that story. And, uh, maybe I can put some color in and easy for me to find out. 
Let me do some of this direction. Of this direction. Upon a time, there was a little, little girl. Her name is Dalan. Dalan, which means big lazy. And uh, all she wanted to do was to do the things she liked and uh, not anything that uh, she does not like. She was so lazy and she couldn't be bothered to do anything she does not like. For example, she does not like to do her homework and uh, the teacher give her homework and she always try to find a reason not to do her homework. And uh, Dalan has uh, a friend whose name is uh, whose name was Qin Qin. Qin Qin. Qin Qin means uh, diligent and hardworking. And uh, Dalan, 
the big lazy and the diligent hard working girl the two of them are the best friends but they are so different because Balan the big lazy she does not want to do anything she want to do and she does not want to do she did not want to do anything she did not like and she only wanted to do the things she wanted she was so 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 mm -mm, lazy and um, <clears throat> her friend Qin Qin, she was so diligent. Every day she should find something to do. If there is, if there was nothing to do, then she would be depressed and very sad feel felt meaningless for his her life so because of their character they became the best friends because uh, Dalan the big lady did not want to do things and she asked Qin Qin, the hard-working girl, to help her. And uh, so that uh, the hard-working girl could always find something, could always find something to do, and uh, could be away from sadness, and uh, nothingness and, uh, away from being meaningless in life so they were the best of friends and uh, so the teacher gave them homework and uh, every time Qin Qin will do the homework one by one very 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 carefully but Dalan she would not do that and uh, <clears throat> one day the teacher gave them the homework like this let me find a piece of paper. Okay. Let me find a piece of paper. So one day the teacher wrote a homework like this. Two plus three plus five plus eight plus six plus seven plus five plus nine plus one and then Qin Qin will do the homework two plus five, five plus ten, ten, eighteen, eighteen, twenty-four, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, thirty-three, thirty-three, thirty-six, 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 thirty-six 36, 44, 36, 36, 45, 45, 40, 45, and uh, 46. So <clears throat> this is uh, how uh, Qin Qin will do the hard working girl. And then the Da Lan, she was so lazy. She never she couldn't be bothered to count all this 
and then she found ten, three, seven, ten, five, five, ten, nine, one, ten, only four left, so one, two, three, four is forty six. So she will be so lazy, she never, she couldn't bother to do the, all these things. And she always find little tricks. For example, 99 square minus 1, square 1. So instead of Qin uh, Qin will do like this. 九九八十一九九八十一八十九九九八十一八十九零九加八九加八十加八等于十加八等于十加八等于八九八零一再减去一等于九八零零 and then this is Qin Qin's method and Da Lan. She will do like this equal ninety nine plus one times ninety nine minus one. So ninety nine plus one is one hundred times ninety eight. So equal nine eight zero zero. So she's so lazy, Dala. And the big lazy always look for tricks to find things. So, and, um, <clears throat> and, um, let me do my drawing. I will not waste my time doing those things. So, Dala was for tricky ways of doing things and never look for a straight way and uh, we're never going back home or doing anything everything Qin Qin will hard working diligent to walk all the way through but Da Lan will always look for an easy way of doing things because she was so lazy and um, <clears throat> and uh, mm -hmm. I do not do not want to use my brain and she was so tala she was so lazy she does not even want to use her brain to tell a story she just wanted to do anything she likes she enjoys she likes to do doodles and the scribbles and uh, anything fun and fancy and uh, nothing important, nothing, nothing, nothing at all important. She just do not want to do anything important. She just want to do things that are not important so 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 unimportant so 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 lazy she so one day 
and Qing Qing, they are going to take an examination because this is the end of the school term and uh, it's time for examination and um, <clears throat> the big lazy Dalan she was so lazy she couldn't bother to do the exercise and she was doing something very 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 wrong you know she was uh, <clears throat> she was doing something so wrong that i do not even dare to make up that story maybe i should make up this story She was just so they were having an examination and <clears throat> Talan she did not do any of the answer she asked Qin Qin to do the answer and tell her the answer but it is examination time and uh, <clears throat> it is not allowed to copy from others so Dalan decided to use some secret message whenever the test is <clears throat> multiple choice there is answer A and B and C and D and um, the teacher give them the test paper and they are going to write down A or B or C or D and uh, Dalan did not even look at the test all she looked is her friend Qin Qin but they were separate and their chair their desk were far away of course Dalan could not see what is written, but they have already worked out something. That is, whenever Qin scratch her hair one time, that means the choice is A. Whenever she scratch two times, the answer is B. And three times is C and four times is D. And uh, <clears throat> so the whole test Qin Qin 
kept scratching hairs one time or two times or three times or four times or one time or four times or one time or three times or two times or one times she kept scratching and then because she was scratching so much the teacher found out and teacher asked what are you doing and um, and Qin uh, <clears throat> said I did not wash my hair so I feel itchy and the teacher thought it was quite suspicious but uh, he could not find any reason so the test finished and uh, Dalanda got a very good result and the teacher was very angry because he knows Dala never study hard but he got very, she got very good score. So this time the teacher decide to change the test from multiple choice into question and answer. The question is, for example, how to draw a doodle. Of course, you cannot answer such a question with yes or no. Or, what is a pen and ink drawing. Tell me the most famous artist in the doodle history. Something that really cannot be answered by yes or no, by A or B, C or D. So it's a, a big challenge. Before the test, Dalan, she was so lazy. She couldn't be bothered to do the test to prepare. And she was practicing the whole night how to make each letter a secret code so that uh, when Qin Qin give any action Da Lan she could translate into her own language and write it down so the whole night whole day Da Lan was working on it the next day was the test and uh, this time Qin Qin was doing all sort of actions sometimes scratch head sometimes pick nose sometimes holding hand sometimes <gasps> sigh and sometimes scratch ear and sometimes look to sky sometimes look to floor sometimes look left sometimes turn right it was like a monkey show but the teacher could not find any pattern because last time uh, Chi Chi was always scratching her head and this time she was doing all sort of actions. 
so the test finished and the teacher corrected the test and Dalan, the big lazy, got her score. Could you imagine which score she got? Of course, she got the best score as good as Qin Qin. Exactly the same result as Qin Qin. And uh, <clears throat> the teacher was very, very angry, but uh, he could not find anything because Dalan, she was so, so, so lazy. She couldn't bother. She couldn't be bothered to do any study. And all she has done was developing her own secret code with Qin um, Qin. And her secret code became the most, most, most secure and safe code in the whole wide world. Even the most famous, big, smartest, sharpest hackers could not decode those secret codes developed by Dalan and Qin Qin. Do you hate my story? How much do you dislike my story? Please tell me I will be so eager to listen to your idea so that I can make up a lot, a lot, a lot of the lazy story. Okay. So, so, so happy. Then there is one day, Dalan was very, very, very lazy, the big lazy. She was so lazy and She couldn't be bothered to go out to do something she has to do because she was having so much fun to do the things she liked. But her stomach is gully 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 singing because she was hungry and she couldn't be bothered to go out and there was a new restaurant fast food restaurant opened just outside Dalan's house not far away and they sell all kinds of famous good food and um, but 
大了 ，she was so lazy. She couldn't be bothered to go out to buy the food, so she made her own food. And there is a lot, a lot, a lot. Of story about how Dalan is going to make her food. My ink is running out, and my idea is running out. Life sometimes comes to a narrow corner. You just cannot move around. Then don't bother to move. Be lazy. Don't. Be too hardworking and do all the things. Find your shortcut. Look for your shortcut. Do you want to listen my story of Dalan's food experience? I have so many not yet made up. I will be so happy to make them up. Running out of ink. It is so so.
Bye-bye.